What is up, what is up, what is up, FS Club, FS Daily News. Hopefully you guys are all having a good Wednesday. Let's get to that news. Remember guys, if you guys haven't already done it, make sure you guys put in the comment section below, hashtag FS Daily News. Okay, here we go. First thing is from White Bull Modding. A big update for the Hill of Slovenia is coming. More info soon. Thanks to Farming Agency and the Alien Paul for collaboration with us to make this update. As you guys can see that from the pictures, it looks really, really good. I believe the alien Paul is the person who is actually helping Oxy with Sandy Bay, if I'm not mistaken. I'm 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 pretty sure. Anyways, there is that one. Next one we have is from Mr. MJ Modding. Of course, he is making the Tom Pepperton's farm. Uh, this is his next project. He's going to be really kicking it into high gear, working on it whenever Gatehead gets released for PC and consoles. Uh, he said, as we are making all the new models for the map, we have decided to add a little more smaller details to the sheds. Uh, like adding nuts and bolts and also adding support frames. Nothing big, but just making the models look a bit more realistic. We'll be releasing a lot more plans, updates for the map after Gatehead is out on the mod hub. But I can say one thing, one of the things that we are adding is you will, uh, you will be able to move your cows from field to field or even around the yard to different pens or sheds. So pretty much the grazing. Uh, that's pretty cool right there. We will try our hardest to start the map ASAP as we know there's a lot of people excited for this map. So there is that on the Tom Pepperton's farm. I'm saying that right? <laughs> so there we go with that one. Next ones guys, these are pretty much updates on all the mods of North Modding Crew, JHHG, and Custom Modding. First thing, NMC, I get this question asked a lot. Here are some upcoming projects they are working on. Now the Broit X20 and the X20 TL rebrand for consoles, the John Deere 948L11, the John Deere 843L11, and then let's see, the three models in the work, the Huddig 1260D and the Ferguson Implements, Texture and XML and Scripting, uh, the Cat Dozer D11, which is the NMC for consoles, and then in testing by NMC is the ETT90 plus the Timber Trailer, and they've already sent off two giants, the Ponzi Elephant King with Hook Lift. So wow, they are busy, busy, busy on that one. So there is from NMC, guys. The next one is from JHHG Modding. He said, today is a week since its release. Our John Deere, the S600 series, the 700, and of course the corn header headers for PC and console. Thank you to over 800,000 downloads and a 4.8 rating. Wow. And you know, guys, those are mostly console players. Uh, yes. It's time to raise the topic of European specifications of these machines. Yes, we just sent an update to the official mod up, which will include the John Deere S600 i series and the John Deere S700 i series. So there's also going to be the European versions, which will be coming soon. So basically, if you're on that European map, guys, you can actually switch over and do the Europe versions of these. We are talking with Giant Software about the possibility to include the proper European versions of our S series combines for Mac and console players. They didn't allow us to send separate mods with these specifications, but updates with two different specifications in shop are of course possible. Except new European versions, you will be able to see few description fixes which you monitored before. European specification S series will include the S680i, the S685i, the S690i, the S780i, the S785i, and the S790i models. Uh, proper design and details, separate configurations, correct for EU spec, EU decals and safety labels, EU warning uh, warning sides, which uh, there will be configurations for that, and EU extremity lights. Same animations and features like the North American version. So summarizing, you'll have to give Giants software something around a week if there will no, no monitored issues before you will see these two John Deere mods updates on official mod up. We will inform you. So I cannot wait for these. Mainly if you're gonna be playing, you know, like Sandy Bay or something like that. So we can still use that John Deere as the Europe configuration. So there is that one right there. The last thing to go over is custom modding. I know a lot of people have been asking about what are they working on? Where is this? Where is that? Okay, here is basically all their projects they are working on. Projects that are on the release list. The John Deere 2680H high speed disc. As course, guys, it is released. The John Deere 8RT US, the developing 3D tracks, fully functional. Uh, let's see, an update for the 2019 John Deere 9RT for PC and Mac, developing 3D tracks, fully functional. 
the ongoing projects right now. The John Deere C850 air card, it's already in the game, I would say about 85% functional. The John Deere 1870 air drill, finished model, making the item and then in game. The John Deere 4940 self propelled sprayer, I get a lot of questions about this one. Still finishing the 120 foot boom sprayer. Yes, folks, this is a big tiring job. Then we also have, let's see, that is it for the consoles ones. Uh, let's see. The next one, new projects they are working on. The Case IH 2000 series early riser planters, PC, Mac, and console. Yes, it's true. Duca is very excited about this project. In three days, he pra practically modeled the entire frame. Wow. A uh, project started but currently stopped. Uh, let's see, for Mac and consoles, uh, the minor map, they haven't done anything with that and the Case IH Axle Flow 250 Series Combine. So there is all of their stuff. If you guys can pause the screen, you guys can actually see the project status on all their stuff. Well guys, that is all the news for today. Let me know what you guys are excited about. Remember guys, I will be live streaming tonight at 8.30 p.m. Central Standard Time on No Man's Land. That's an awesome map. So if you did like it, make sure you guys pound that like button. If you have a sudden, make sure you guys do, and like always, have an all-state farmers. Peace.